clipped in. And then the clips go on really nice when they're on the wall as well. Again, just go in like this and bang, you're in nice and easy. Okay, so now what I was talking about earlier. So you can see here, we don't have a full six inches here to this top edge. What Andre had to do was he had to pre-cut this piece on a table saw. So you need, a, again, a non-ferrous blade. He basically measured from here to the groove to the bottom edge here, and then he cut the tongue off, okay? So you have to cut the tongue off in order for this to work. With this top course, we don't want the top here to rattle because we don't have the lip. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna grab a system clip from our panel system, which is the same. We're gonna be selling these with the plank system. And we're gonna just pop this guy on the end like that. And now we've got a resting point for the top piece. So it has a nice cushioned edge and it feels nice and tight at any given time. It's not gonna rattle, make noise in the wind, any of that kind of stuff, okay? You can see now once we cap everything in, you're gonna have a nice tight fit. Make sure that I start the groove edge against the wall that I'm starting on so that the tongue is always on the outside edge accepting the next piece of plank. We're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna put these clips on this way. Boom, one there. Put that at the bottom. Okay, and then we're gonna put another one on here. We wanna just get it on nice and nice and level and bang, bang, nice and easy. I'm gonna clip. And we're gonna screw that guy in. Beautiful. I'm gonna clip. We've got the same scenario here as we did over here on our horizontal, okay? We have to trim this piece back. Remember, we have a door here, okay? We pretended there's a door. We don't have a door but there's a door here and now we have to take this clank and we're going to get it inside that edge. Uh, we've already put the clips on the back plate so that we have a nice, clean, nice, tight look, okay? 